Nope. <laughs> Driving the car. Think again. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's your name? Sean Hendrick. Nice to meet you, Sean. Where do you work? I work at uh, Eurocycles of Orlando. What's your position there? I'm a sales guy. What do you like about working at Eurocycles of Orlando? Well, uh, yeah, I am a people person and uh, I love meeting new people. Uh, the team and uh, everybody here, I mean, it, it's. Let me let me not call it a team. We're a family. Yeah. That's, let me put it that way. Yeah. So I I, I do like um, the atmosphere and the, the vibes and the energy that we do have here nice. in, the, in the store. That's awesome. So the, the desk right by the door when they when the customers come first, in is great for you. First face that you see, it's like like Aaron says. Every, I, every time he comes here and he doesn't see me, he's like I miss I miss that big smile on yeah. your face because. That's the first thing he sees when he comes in. Do you ride motorcycles? I do, I do. Yeah. I don't ride as much as I would like to um, because my commute, uh, it's all traffic, you know, so it, it's yeah. not enjoyable. It's as not an enjoyable I would ride. Love. Yeah, but definitely, yes. What do you ride right now? Right now, um, I have two bikes, actually. I have a, a Triumph Bobber, okay. a Bobber Black, awesome. and uh, a uh, Suzuki DRZ. I have a lot of fun with that uh, nice. CRZ. It reminds me of when I was young, uh, riding my uh, motocross. I used to do motocross when I was young. Yeah, yeah. So, so you, you kind of have your gentleman's bike and your hooligan bike. Correct. Nice. Yeah. Uh, what would be your best two-wheeled experience? What made you fall in love with ri riding motorcycles? Well, uh, this, uh, this has got to go back when I was eight years old. Uh, my neighbors uh, for Christmas, Got uh, both of them got motorcycles, and I was like, "Wow, you guys are so lucky." So I had a dream in my mind, and and I was like, "One day, when I'm all grown up and I can pay for a motorcycle myself, I'm getting it." So uh, that first bike uh, that I got actually was a um, one of those uh, Spree. Is it? It's like a little moped. It's a 50 cc okay. moped. Um, that time it was uh, five hundred and fifty dollars, but it was to me. It, it, I'm guessing I was like what, thirteen. I started uh, washing cars and whatnot and saving my money for me to buy that bike, and it was. I, I still remember I get goosebumps just thinking about that. That's awesome. All yeah. the memories with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. Past, present, possibly future. What would you? What do? What do you wish you could own? Um. The uh, Ducati X Diabolas. The X Diabolas. Yeah, that's one of my uh, one of my favorite bikes. What would you say is your favorite thing to do on two wheels? Just ride, enjoy, enjoy Just the ride. ride. Yeah, riding with my dad. Nice. Yeah. What would you say is your favorite place to ride? Would it be Puerto Rico? It or? will be definitely, definitely in Puerto Rico. Yes, definitely. Why should people stop by your cycles of Orlando and come see Sean? Well, like I said, um, this uh, right here, we don't we don't treat uh, our customers. As customers, uh, I do treat them as family. When I give you my uh, my business card, have all my information, you have my personal number. And uh, when you buy a bike from me, I don't say like, okay, now I'm gonna take you to the uh, service department, the part. Like, call me, if you need parts, I'll get you through parts. If you need uh, to make an appointment, I'll do that for you. If I have to make the appointment for you, I mean, yeah, again, I. I I'm not a sales guy, and at that point, you know, you, you become my family once yeah. you uh, once you walk in that door. I see. You. I understand why Aaron put you up front then. Exactly. <laughs> well, thank you for your time, Sean. We look thank forward you. to seeing you out there. All right.